the best comment I ever had in a um, guest book. Somebody must have carried their own marker because it was in huge print and they wrote, this shit sucks. My work is done, you know, if you can provoke somebody to that degree. It's just my, it's just my art. Why, what, how, how are you getting so upset? Anything that you do that causes some provocation is political, whether it's a positive provocation or negative. And something as simple as uh, suspending a two liter uh, bottle of orange soda, strip the label off and hang that from a tree in Miami Beach, people went insane. Local street people, homeless people, average Joes on the street, they couldn't come to terms with it because you're presenting them something familiar in a new context and that's very disturbing. You can say you like it or you don't like it, but what does that mean? It, it exists and in the same way that a person simply exists, your, your existence is all the justification you have to have. And so I'm, can you create an artwork that exists on its own justification only and needs no outside criteria to, to substantiate it. There was a, a blog review of this current show that really tore me a new one. They sort of chopped me up in a million pieces and left me out to dry. Thing is, I kind of agreed with them all across the board on it. But at the same time, they were trying to fill their need to answer their questions that they thought my work was raising. But you can't, it's apples and oranges. You can't, you can't critique this for this game when you're not playing that game. A lot of people don't think I do anything because it's a little twisting, a little tying, a little stacking, you know, a few drops of color here and there. Um, I don't, you know, I can't, I can't speak to that. I'm, I'm the busiest person I know. So I, I work very hard to do nothing. <laughs> that may not be a good quote. <laughs> I'd rather have somebody tell me that it sucks than just walk away.